welcome students in my new tutorial and today i'll be covering the topic subtotals so what is subtotal this is very beneficial topic the subtotal tool in calc creates the group automatically and applies common functions like sum average on the grouped data so it creates the group automatically and not only group it also applies common functions and the common functions are sum, average, max, minimum. According to our need, we can apply this kind of common functions. One can use any type of summary function for each column as per the requirement of data analysis. So practically, I'll be explaining you. So directly now I'm taking you towards the practical. So I have taken one example. You can also create this in your spreadsheet. So simple spreadsheet has been made, region, product and sales and some fictitious data has been there. North, apples, 1200, like, likewise south, apples, 1000. Same way it's been divided. Now I want to group the data and region wise I want to group and to find the sales region wise. This is not region wise, okay. So how to do that? It's very easy in spreadsheet. Directly, I can go to data and here I will find subtotal option. I will click upon this. So, by default, it is showing region. Now, first group. So this is I am giving the example of first group and uh, I am here in subtotals dialog box. And you could see here calculate subtotals for region, product, sales and these options are coming from here. Region, product and sales from here. Now, these functions I could use, sum, count, average, max, mean and so on. So, first of all, I want to group region wise and then I want to find the sales region wise. So, I will click upon sales and what I want to find? Sum. So, if I click on OK, you will find that it has find the total region wise and total is according to the sales. So overall sales of north region is 2500. The same way the overall sales of south region is 2400 and so on. I will do the undo command. Control Z. The same way I can go to data once again. Subtotals and if I want to find product wise although it is product wise already it's sorted product wise and i want to find the sales and do the sum now okay you will find now it is coming according to product wise like apple the sale of the apples apple sum then banana sum and orange sum i hope this is clear how the work is going on how this subtotal option is helping me so one more i could take i'll again do undo command data subtotals and uh, suppose i am finding product wise only and uh, sales and from here i want to find the maximum sales product wise i'll click on ok so now it is giving me the result the maximum sale of apple is 1200 you could see here on the top and uh, banana's max is 800 it is showing here and same way orange max is 650 so i hope my first example is very much clear to you how to use subtotal now you also do the same thing you can just write this data on your spreadsheet and do as i have told you okay and then when i'll ask you then share the screenshots now going to the second example i've already made the sheet so that it becomes easier for you so what i have done here i have given three columns company product and sales 
So you can also do the same thing. You can make some fictitious company and then product like I have taken keyboard, mouse, keyboard, pen drive like this. Then fictitious sales. Now I want to do the subtotals options here also. I'll go to data, subtotals. Firstly, the same way. I want to do the subtotal according to the first group. Although there is first group, second group and third group. Two type of groups I can use, even three type of groups I can use according to the criteria or according to the need. So I'll be using first group just now as I've used earlier in my previous example. And here I want to group by the company. Group by the company. And here I want to find the sales. Click on sum and then OK. Now if you'll find it has sorted according to the company wise and then product wise and C company sum is 6200. The same way JJ company it has given the result here. Overall sum that means overall sales is 2000 and then KJ 11,000 and RR 3700 and grand sum is 22,900. So I hope this is clear. I'll again do undo command control plus Z. And then again going to subtotals. Now I want to use two type of grouping. Just now I was using only one type of grouping. Same way I'll be using company, first group and then again the sales. This is same earlier I was telling you. But now I want to do grouping according to product wise also. So I could go to second group. Here I want to group according to the product. And here also I want to click on sales and sum. That means under group another group is been created. Now let's see the result. So I'll click on OK. Now if you'll see here same way CC company and overall result of the C company is been shown. CC company some 6200 but product wise also it is showing the result. Like keyboard total 3500, mouse sum 2000 and pen drive 700. Same way CC company, okay, JJ company, mouse sum and pen drive sum. Then KJ again mouse sum and pen drive sum. So I hope the two levels of grouping is also very much clear to you. And uh, single level of grouping is also clear that I have explained you. So with these two examples, I think so that the concept of subtotal should be clear to you. With this, I'll be closing my tutorial. And if you like my explanation, then please do like, share and comment. And also subscribe my channel if you have not subscribed it earlier. Okay, bye-bye. Take care. Meet you soon in my next tutorial.